Transformers and Boomation fans alike. I'm your host, Kyle the Boomation Guy, here to give you the video review for Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Interrogator Barricade. First, let me take little annoying little Sam away from here, along with Ravage, who was probably worth every cent, and this giant ass Bumblebee. I mean, just look at how big he is. Barricade could definitely not stand up to that thing. Anyway, putting this aside, where the hell do I put it? Up here. I'll just put it up here. Anyway, here's what he looks like. It's basically a remold of the original Barricade from the 2007 movie. It says right here, to punish and enslave, like it did in the movie. Please, little purple Decepticon police logo. And these are new. Replacing Frenzy, they got these uh, probe things, they call it. Basically, what you want to do is just take it out from the front by opening the grate. And put that off to the side. You'll need that for later. So what you start off for transformation is you pop it open on the side by grabbing it right there. And you're and there's going to be a little bit of a prong right there, so just push it down and then pull it out. Because you can see there's something right there. And do the same on the other side. So that looks like this. Now that you have it like that, you want to turn around and just take this whole bottom piece and you can see right here pretty clearly just to put it right there. Like that. Just clip it in so it's at an angle. Don't worry if it doesn't go in flat. It's supposed to be at an angle. Then open the legs up to the sides like that. Uh, bend the knee down. Do the same on this side open up and open up the feet. Now the instructions don't say to do this but I think it just looks a little bit better. There's a little bit of a fold right here. Just push on that and you'll get like a heel guard or something. So just do that. Now on the top you're gonna wanna open it up like this all the way. Just like that. Then fold this down and try to stick your thumb in there. I really haven't perfected this yet. Stick your thumb in there. Just push up Barricade's head. Just like that. Now he has that head. And just squeeze these two top parts together and as far as they can onto Barricade's head. Just to strangle him or something. Next, uh, fold up the side windows from the vehicle mode. And, um,. One second, this takes a little bit of a doing because his ankles are really, really loose on this figure. Not too sure why, but, it, you know, I don't care. Hasbro, Hasbro just makes it like this. Ah, come on, I I'll just bend his knees at an angle. It'll look like he's taking a dump in the woods, but, you know, that's as good as I can probably get it. Anyway, this is Interrogator Barricade. He is uh, pretty much the same exact thing as uh, the 2007 model. It's pretty awesome, pretty accurate to the movie description. It has uh, these hands. The hands aren't very accurate, but I don't really care. Um, the head does not spin at all, but it's very accurate. These things, I have not figured out what to do with these side wheel things yet. But, um... Here he is, and this is Transformers Revenge of the Fallen uh, Interrogator Barricade, so I recommend you pick it up, it's cheaper than the ones like uh, like Ravage, this guy cost me, what, 12, 13 bucks, this guy just cost me 11, like the old 2007 models. Well, um, it's getting pretty late, and I have to make some time to edit this video, so uh, please subscribe. If you're not already subscribed, add me as your friend. And please comment on this video um, asking what other Transformers you want me to review.